Hello, very good evening. Um, inserting and working with joints is a very uh, essential in order to create a good rig. In this tutorial tip, we will learn how you can insert a joint in a rig after it has been created. So, for example, if you have a rig, uh, it's already there and you need to insert a joint in this particular rig. Basically, you, uh, how should we do that? I'm Dr. Shan Bhatti from the Shan Academy. Uh, if you haven't subscribed my channel, uh, do kindly subscribe down below and click on the like icon so that you can get the updates. Now, in order to... Um, <clears throat> insert a joint in a already developed rig or for example you have developed a rig and you forgot to insert a joints a roll joints or later on you realize that you need do you do need a roll joints or certain additional joints in within your uh, rigging stress setup or skeletal setup all you need to do is is go into rigging menu set uh, we go into skeleton and insert joint now the, again you can see there's no options here because quite a simple and straightforward tool uh, so you can just click on the insert joint tool here then you need to click on a parent so for example this is my um, almost uh, mid uh, sh elbow or um, shoulder roll kind of a joint uh, because this is a shoulder this is just bicep but I need another joint in the middle that actually has a more uh, cartoony kind of a look and similarly at the forearm as well. So in order to insert the joints, what basically I need to do is I need to click on the parent joint and click and drag. Uh, parent joint basically means the joint that is under which the new child joint is going to be created. So you just click and drag and joints there. So for example, if I have this joint, just click and drag on that joint. So when which jo Whichever joint you click on will automatically become parent and then when you drag it, you set the direction under which the ch child is going to be created and it's as simple as that so you can create parent and child joint under anything so if i click and drag i have a parent and child joint under here again i need to click on the parent first that this is going to be my parent and as soon as i drag i have the child joint available underneath it so similarly if i can create uh, joints under any certain hierarchical setup that i want very easily and very quickly um, again the only thing that you do need to be a little bit careful of because this is already skinned geometry as well uh, so if i come here you can see this this skin is fine but the new joint that i created might not work appropriately with the skin and as you can see this the skin is breaking that's because uh, obviously it is drawing the joint hierarchy due to which the rest of the arm is moving but the vertices around this area are not controlled by this new joint and we need to adjust the skin again uh, and skin weights need to be adjusted again around these new joints so they can move properly and appropriately otherwise you can see this that i start to have skin breaking occurring at certain points and some joints would not basically or the skin would not basically work as desired so yes it does break the skin by inserting new joints but at least you get a new joint that you can now work with and then the, those skin areas and vertices can be controlled using um, skin weights and skin and uh, vertices weights tools very easily i might i might just show you the next lecture okay thank you very much this is dr nishan buddy kindly do subscribe my channel see you around thank you